So I'm gonna make a mob farm. And yes, I know it's just day 27. Okay, that's just the day we normally do it. I don't care. Roll intro. <laughs> farm and with the mob farm I'm gonna get some stuff I don't know So if you don't know what this is, this is a mob farm. So a bunch of mobs spawn, and then they fall down, and, and then I, I, I kill them. And I want to get the 30 levels, and I'm totally not filming this out of order, because um, that's not why I have 30 levels, so yeah. So I built a mob farm. So now I'm gonna build a thing on top of my house. But I need to get some wood, so and then okay guess that works okay so i have a bunch of wood stuff now i'm gonna build another thing on top of my house and then i'm gonna build an iron farm so house thing first go Okay, so I just did the thing on my house. Now I'm gonna get some redstone for the iron farm. So, you know, montage. <laughs> Okay, so I know there's a lot of montages in this video, but I honestly don't care, so let's go. Okay, so I just made the iron farm, and I like it pretty good. But now I want to make a super smelter, because I want to smelt things fast. And I have a bunch of copper. So, yeah. So I made the super smelter. My thought process to why is it here is when you're coming back from the mines, you're probably gonna have a lot of stuff you wanna smelt. And having a super smelter right next to it is pretty convenient. And I can just put all of this stuff in here and then it all goes into this. And I can this, put that into here. And I have it mixed with these, so if I want like food, because blast furnaces cannot smell food, but furnaces can smell everything. So the blast furnaces are for like the ores and stuff and the furnaces are like for food. So, yeah. So then I turn it on. Okay, it's done. That's all of it. The reason why I did this is because while I was editing it, the video was like three minutes long, and my limit for how short the videos can be is four minutes. So, yeah, I don't really know what else to do. Bye.